Hello everyone, I'm out here on 18 at Persimmon. I've hit my drive a little wayward to the left and I found myself with a fairly difficult shot here. I'm somewhat on an uphill lie, but I still have to keep it low at the same time. So I got to try to get this ball over the slope in front of me, but also at the same time, keep it underneath that tree. So the first goal in mind is I got to choose a club that has enough loft to get over the hill, but not too much loft so that I can keep it underneath the tree. Very difficult shot. Um, not one you practice very often, but you'll sometimes need to hit this. So I'm going to give you the best way for you to be able to hit this shot underneath the tree and hopefully get it on the green. So I've chosen for this shot uh, my 21 degree driving iron. It's going to give me just enough loft to get over the hill in front of me and then also keep it underneath the tree. This is going to be a punch shot, meaning I'm going to try to keep my hands in front of this golf ball at impact, thus de-lofting the face a little bit, striking down on the ball to get good contact, and driving it low underneath the tree. Now, I know a lot of you are familiar with this shot. My goal here is just to get it over the path, land it on the down slope, and let it run out to the hole. I got a lot of slope that's going to help me once I get it past this tree, and if I execute it well, I'll be on the green and maybe even have a good look at birdie. There we go. Well, I achieved my two goals. I got it over the slope in front of me and underneath the tree. And it looks like it's just rolled onto the right side of the green. So next time you're in this scenario, make sure that you play that ball just back in your stance. Make sure the hands are gonna have ball, uh, beat the club head to the golf ball and punch it underneath the tree.